P.J. Washington, another stellar performance. He had 29 points in game two. He followed that up with 27 points today. Kyrie had 22. He turned it up in the second half as usual. Luka is hurt out there, but he still had 22 points and 15 rebounds. Ooh, 15 rebounds. And then Derek Lively, when they were playing Hacker Lively, when they got into the penalty, he hit the free throws when it mattered most, and they had to stop that shit. We take a 2-1 series lead. We got another game here on Monday. We need to finish this team off in five, because if we don't, the refs are going to make sure they come back. And speaking of the refs, the Oklahoma City Thunder, they are playing dirty, disgusting basketball. And this is bad. This is terrible. This is absolutely fucking terrible. Of course, they're playing hack lively and they're doing everything in their power, Lou Dort, to destroy Luka Doncic. They're just like, <laughs> they're playing so fucking foul out there. And the refs are not calling it, man. Lou Dort had about 30 plus fouls today and they only called six. He should have fouled out in the goddamn second quarter with all the shit he's been doing to Luka this series. And he's intentionally trying to hurt him. He's playing linebacker out there, man. He's playing linebacker. This motherfucker's trying to be Vontaze Perfect on the basketball court. This is bullshit. The league needs, and you know what? The league isn't going to do anything. The league wants this to happen. The league hates Luka. The league is has a, a extreme love affair with Shea Gilgis Alexander. You touch him, he goes to the fucking line. You can throw three guys at fucking Luka Doncic, he gets nothing. You can throw Lou Dort at him. You can throw Jalen Williams at him. You can throw Chet Holmgren on him. You, they can throw their bodies all over them. <laughs> Chet Holmgren pushed Tim Hardaway Jr. to the ground. Like, he literally just pushed him to the ground off of a rebound. And they called it on Tim Hardaway. They called the foul on Tim Hardaway. I'm like, what the fuck? He can push some dude. He can push a dude to the ground intentionally. And nothing gets called on that. I'm telling you, it's the league is out to get my Mavericks and Luka Doncic. But they are still so fucking good. They're too good for OKC and they're still winning. They're playing against the refs and the OKC Thunder, and they're still winning. I am sick and fucking tired of watching this disgusting, dysfunctional, off-brand bad boy Pistons get away with this, man. I'm tired of it, man. We need to destroy this team in five games and move on. I just hate seeing football on the basketball court. I'm a huge football fan. Y'all know that. But I don't like seeing it on the goddamn basketball court. And that's what Lou Dort and the Oklahoma City Thunder, that's what they're doing right now. And it's disgusting. But shout out again to P.J. Washington. He has been a godsend. Thank God we traded for him. Derek Lively has been putting in amazing minutes, along with Daniel Gafford. But Derek Lively has been incredibly impactful. And Daniel Gafford is dealing with a lot of injuries. He's getting destroyed out there. They're beating up on him. And they're not calling a goddamn thing. <laughs> See y'all for game, uh, game four. Monday night. Peace.